guys, Merry Christmas. I am so excited. Christmas is like my favorite, favorite, favorite time of the year. Today, I'm gonna be showing you what Santa Claus is going to be putting in my children's Christmas stockings this year. Just to give you a few ideas of stocking fillers that you could use to fill up your kids stockings. My children, the youngest is two and the eldest will be four in a month. So these things are suitable for like ages two to four. Here's their stocking and the first thing that I've got are playing cards. It's not snack, it's some kind of game that's like suitable for children three and up. Then got them a toothbrush. They go through like five toothbrushes a year, like they just destroy them. Toothbrushes do not last in our house at all. They got some stickers. They are obsessed with stickers, love stickers. They just kind of put them all over their body and put them on furniture and things. And then some more stickers. These ones are like bigger ones. These are kind of like 3D ones, like they stick out. Some bubbles. You can't go wrong with bubbles. The only thing I don't like about bubbles is they make the floor like wet and slippy and they can slip on them. So new rule is when we use bubbles, we only use them outside. Next thing are some crayons. They are obsessed with drawing at the moment. They just want to draw all the time. So I got them a little pack of crayons each and a little Hello Kitty note tag because they see me writing my lists and they like to pretend to write lists too and they can use this notepad to, you know, with their crayons they can draw. I then found these amazing like, little mini books. This is Alice in Wonderland, like in Spanish, because like we live in Spain, so it's hard to find books in English. <laughs> but Alicia in el País de las Maravillas, so it's Alice in Wonderland. And it's great, it's just like a little mini book. It's quite easy, like it's not like difficult, so they'll be able to understand it. So I got them one of them each as well. Kinder egg. They are obsessed with Kinder eggs. <laughs> they love them. So every year I put a Kinder egg in their stocking. My husband chose this. This is a little pot of like gungee gel. So it's like you put your finger in it. It's like kind of silly putty. Like you put your finger in it and it makes like squishy like farting noises. It's actually called like cubo de pedos. Cubo de pedos is farting bucket. <laughs> So it's like a farting bucket like you put your hand in and it makes farting noises. I had to get them their chocolate coins. Christmas is not Christmas without your, your chocolate coins. The last thing is just a little bag of jelly sweets. So I went to the shop and got a mixture of jelly sweets, the ones that they love, and put them in a little bag and they can open that on Christmas morning as well. And that is it with that amount of things the stocking is not even full yet. Like I can actually fit a lot more things in there. So if I see a few more things between now and Christmas, I might add to it. I find it a bit addictive, stocking fillers. Like I don't know, I just like have the desire to just keep buying more things to fill up. Other things I've seen are like kids bubble bath, their favorite candy, like their favorite sweets, toothpaste to go with the toothbrush, special socks, like maybe their favorite Disney character socks, little bouncy balls. I mean, there's so many ideas, like there's so many little gifts that you can get. I hope this video gave you some ideas. Let me know down below what you have put in your kids' stockings this year. I'd love to know because as I said, I've still got a little bit of room there, so I can still add something to give me some more ideas. And I hope you enjoyed this video guys and Merry Christmas to y'all. I hope you are really enjoying getting into the Christmas spirit. I hope you're enjoying the build up to Christmas and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!